so here we are. We are now on the next project. Um, if you haven't guessed already, you can't read. It's going to be small boiler. Uh, so it's going to be uh, we're going to build this up as a coal fire boiler, and this is the uh, GLR Kellens four inch uh, coal fire boiler. It also, can be uh, actually uh, gas as well. Probably meth as well if you really wanted to, but uh, certainly coal and gas. Uh, right, so just a quick overview of the kit of parts. Got the main boiler barrel, the uh, the inner firebox uh, boiler barrel bit, <laughs> top casting, uh, a few bits length of stock for uh, bushes and whatnot. This is going to be the uh, this square is the fire hole. Uh, sorry, no, the fire box ring at the bottom. This plate here, this is actually the plate of copper. We should get uh, the two tube plates, the top and the lower tube plates out of that. Uh, chimney brass, bag of odds and sods, little screws and little bits and bobs for uh, fire hole door and things like that. Now here we've got some lagging with the uh, mahogany inside and uh, the brass banding. Um, so here we are. This should be a reasonably short project, um, although reasonably short depends how much time the kids give me. So, um, first order of the day is probably going to be turning up a uh, former, yes, former for uh, the first fire uh, for the uh, two plate, so the uh, the top two plate, and then also for the fire uh, firebox tube plate as well um, so I got a nice bit of wood uh, really lined up for that we'll um, have a tidy away sort the bench out and we'll come back and quick look at that that's just a quick bit about the uh, the first former so we'll do um, the uh, the top uh, tube plate first uh, which is to fit inside a 4 OD uh, barrel but actually the inside of the barrel is obviously uh, smaller than that because it has some thickness uh, and therefore then this calls for a uh, 3 and 23 32 former diameter so this here is a lump of well it was a uh, sort of base of some some something at some point probably got a bit of a center hole so maybe that's potentially useful uh, it's a bit of scrap it's just over half inch thick or actually Verging or three quarters of an inch thick, so that should be perfect. It feels pretty hard. Um, we'll give it a go, we'll turn it up, we'll see what it's like. Uh, there's a fair amount to come off because it's what five and a half inches diameter, so there's yeah, two inches to come off of that. So we're going to make a mess, um, and I'll bring you back once I've cleared that mess up, I suppose. So you should have just seen a montage of me uh, 
uh, finishing these off. Uh, these are now done, uh, now complete. That is uh, eight mil holes. So that's eight mil rather than uh, five sixteenth, just for um, a bit more of clearance around the actual uh, fire tubes themselves, give a better penetration for uh, uh, the silver solder, which we'll get to at a later date. So that's the wrap for this section. Next section will be concentrating probably more on the fire tubes and also for um, the inner boiler barrel, uh, which I guess is also the firebox. Um, cool, so we'll wrap it there and we'll come back for next time.